Good morning, excuse if I've got like sleep marks on my face and stuff, but I thought I would just kind of show you everything I do in my morning, um, because a lot of you, like I do post morning routines for like clear skin and stuff on my TikTok, but like it's really difficult to show everything. And it's currently almost eight o'clock, I've got some time, and I was just like, why not? Like I don't think anyone's gonna be in the kitchen, like I may as well. Um, so yeah, I've just woken up, made my bed, um, which always looks a bit messy, and I'm just about to go and make my breakfast. Um, so yeah, I thought I would just kind of show you, like, what I use that's, like, essential for my wellness. Also, I just popped that spot, but she needed to be popped, but now she just looks really red. But we'll put a pimple patch on her after, because I've made the mistake far too many times of putting a pimple patch on before breakfast and then like because you're moving your mouth it comes off anyway and then you have to want another one and we can't be doing that in this economy so let's go make my more breakfast okay so i'm in the kitchen in this beautiful lighting and before i do anything i have my brazil nuts i have two brazil nuts every day because they've got lots of selenium in them oh my god why was that so difficult to show you okay now, obviously, use oats. These are the Nares. Nares oats. I'm going to add some of this marine collagen from Six Ways because I'm trying to get onto the collagen hype. That is so funny. And then I'm adding flax seeds and chia seeds. In theory, you should soak your chia seeds. So I'm just going to put a few in, and then, but they're both for your gut health. And then my favourite part is the protein powder. This is in the salted caramel flavour. I've always got a discount code with them, which is Live With Mills. And in a bit when I have my mango greens, that's also the code Live With Mills for 15% off, I believe. I just steal. But I'm running out, so I'm just going to empty the bag into the bowl. I would normally add, I literally don't have anything so I only got back yesterday, but I would normally add some almond butter now, which will provide healthy fat and some more protein, and then I'd add stewed cinnamon apples, which would provide fibre. But, but at the moment, this is all we're working with, so I'm going to be relying a lot on my mango greens to get me my fibre and veggies in, which is why I quite like having them, because like especially at uni, it's such an easy way to get vegetables in even though you should be having vegetables anyway. Look at the line on my forehead from sleeping. Every single night I'm going to sleep with my glasses on and it's giving me, can you see that line there? It's giving me bruises on my nose. Okay, I actually need to stop because it's gonna end up giving me a really wonky nose. So I'm just having my breakfast in my room and I'm having a puka, I think it's called Three Gingers. Three Ginger Tea? Yeah, Three Ginger. Um, because at the moment I'm just really not into my turmeric and ginger shots. I don't know what it is. I think it's more just like the faff of making them. And I genuinely probably haven't had them in like two weeks. Um, so I've been having like a couple ginger teas a day. Well, like it does have turmeric in. It's weird, it's called three gingers and it's turmeric. <laughs> don't know. Um, but obviously like one tea isn't as like strong and concentrated as one shot. So I just have like a couple a day. Um, but yeah, I think it's because it's also getting quite cold. I'd rather have a tea. But my skin's been doing okay. Um, considering, so it's whatever, isn't it? The collagen powder is raspberry flavoured. And I'm so used to my porridge tasting like vanilla or salted caramel. It's kind of throwing me off because it's kind of fizzy. Sorry, I've just been watching the Kardashians. I've almost finished my tea. I thought I would just show you like the supplements and things that I am about to take. Um, so, there's quite, quite a few. Um, and I'll explain what each one is for because so many people ask all the time what supplements I take. And I don't want people to just go out and buy supplements because like they're probably not going to work for people because you get supplements based on your specific issues. Do you know what I mean? So it's just like, it's really frustrating when everyone's like, what supplements do you want to take? What supplements do you recommend? It's like, I don't recommend any. 
because I need ones for certain issues and other people will need ones for certain issues and I don't know what anyone else's issues are. So with that being said, I'm gonna show you my supplements. So I'm gonna take one omega-3 capsule. This is um, like anti-inflammatory. I'm gonna take two of my probiotic. Um, you can get stronger probiotics, but this one has got like a specific strain in it that gets rid of a specific bacteria overgrowth that I have specifically in my gut. So like there are better probiotics in this one, but I need this one because it's got a specific strain. And I'm gonna have my multivitamin from Feel. I have two of these. And then I'm gonna have two oregano oils. This is um, again for an overgrowth bacteria I have. I have two of those. I'm gonna have one of these. I think the dosage is two, but I'm gonna have one. These are the um, Feel Immunity tablets. And then the last thing I have is two drops of the green black walnut wormwood complex, sorry. <laughs> um, which I have again because of a specific bacterial overgrowth. And then I'm going to have my Free Soul Greens, the mango greens, of course. They taste so good, honestly. Like, I've been seeing people do, like, not ads, but, like, you know, and they link more on their TikTok shop. Some of the comments are, like, saying they don't taste nice. I'm, like, I genuinely can't understand what, what would make someone so fussy that they think something so delicious doesn't taste nice. Like, I don't get it. Um, so, yeah. Oh, are these the ones that are more full? Let me try and figure out which ones I should use first. Maybe I'll have this one first. So I've got my Free Soul Cup. It says Women's Wellness Club. I've got one there that says Drink Your Greens, but I fancy this one today. I don't know why I've got hiccups. So yeah, as I said earlier, the discount code is Life with Mills. Um, but it's always linked below anyway. So it's just one heaped teaspoon into there. And then normally you add water and ice, but I don't think we've got any ice here because I'm at uni. I'm at uni, like, there's no fancy stuff here. Um, but I need to get a Brita kettle because at the moment I'm literally having to use tap water and it's disgraceful. It is disgraceful. Mm. I look so white. I think it's just the lighting. I mean, I am very pale, but I don't know if I'm this pale. But yeah, so it's almost nine o'clock now. I think I might try and get some work done. Um, or maybe some reading or just something where I'm not just sat scrolling on my phone, which to be honest, it doesn't really happen that often. Normally I'm just like scrolling to like look for like inspo or something like that. <laughs> Oh, I'll tell you my skincare that I just used if you bear with me. Um, oh, I've put it all back. So I obviously use my Mega Water Cream. Um, I've used my Dr. Sam Flawless Neutralizing Gel, um, which is basically a spot treatment, but like you can, I think you can, can put it all over your skin, but it's a Zalic Acid. I'm loving this lip mask, the one I showed you in my last video. Um, and then at the moment I'm testing out this facial oil, which is um, from Monday Muse. It's called The Nectar. It is, um, I like, I put it in the pore clogger list and like checked all the ingredients and there is no pore cloggers, but obviously like facial oils and stuff can, like, even if there's no pore cloggers, like sometimes facial oils just don't really go that well with people that have acne prone to skin. So I am currently testing her on my forehead, which is probably why it looks so shiny compared to the rest of my face. And I use some of the Evercalm Ren Overnight Recovery Balm on my nose here, where I said that um, from my glasses was hurting, but I'm a bit concerned it's not from my glasses and it's a spot, but I'm thinking surely it's not like because I did sleep in my glasses. But yesterday I did put it on. Oh my God, that pimple has gone down so much. It was huge yesterday. Oh my god, let's put some more of this on. 
cool, that's amazing. I wanted to be gone by tomorrow because um, I'm going out and I don't want to put makeup on it. I'm literally just rambling now and I'm going to hate myself when I have to edit this, so I will talk to you in a bit because I've been talking for 10 whole minutes. Hey guys, I think it's 10 o'clock. Oh, it's 25 past 10. God, time just, it runs away with me. Um, I'm just going to read a book now. I need to leave here at about quarter past 12. So I've got like an hour and 45 to just like kind of chill. And then I need to have some lunch before I go, even though that's really early, like 12 o'clock. But I'm not going to be home until 4 is that right? Yeah, one till three, I won't get back till four. And that is obviously way too late to have lunch. Um, so yeah, I don't know what book I'm gonna read. I think I might read Hopeless by Colleen Hoover. Um, yeah, I'm so tired. Like, I don't know, yeah, wait, no, I'm doing a different video right now, aren't I? But at the moment I'm filming like a get out of a rut with me video and that's involving me starting to get up around seven o'clock every day but today is my first day of doing that so i'm really tired but we're gonna stick to it <laughs> watch me fall asleep now no we're gonna stick to it i don't know what to do to energize me because i'm not someone that drinks caffeine we you gonna yeah i'm not someone that drinks caffeine so it's really difficult for me to like wake myself up. I was definitely asleep by 12 last night. So I at least got like seven and a half hours of sleep, but I need at least eight to function. So yeah, so I'm gonna try and get some more tonight. I'm just going to like tick off all of the tasks that I've done in my lovely book. Don't you love this? It's from Papier, Life with Mills work planner but this is what is going to make me get my life together because i've already planned out the next two weeks of my life i've taken my supplements tonight i need to wash my hair i've had my breakfast i was apparently meant to do some uni work but i've done work yeah so that's a big slate from today's tasks but i hope you have a lovely week um, I know this was a bit of a random video, but I'm just trying to get into the swing of posting more um, and trying to just show you guys more of my life. Um, but yeah, I hope you have a lovely day and I will see you this week. Bye.